Hey guys, hey, it is your girl So Fashion Week TV and the place to be and hello, happy Monday. It is Monday, August 19th and we are on cruise countdown. Your girl will be heading out on her uh, Caribbean cruise on August 26th, uh, but I'll be flying out to Fort Lauderdale on Sunday the 25th and of course I'll be taking you guys along for the ride but today today I have a half day scheduled because today is the day that your girl gets her bike plate installed and so yes this is going to be a braces update video for you guys vlog style braces update so we are going to kick it off right now All right guys, so I'm in the car and we are going to see if I can keep you guys steady as I back out of the driveway. So I'm looking real basic today, um, real basic and comfy because it's supposed to be like 90 degrees today. And with that said, I'm just trying to just be as basic and low maintenance looking as possible. And so I just have on a, um, a hoodie yes so I'm just trying to keep it as basic as possible guys so um, I didn't even do an outfit of the day portion because my morning was kind of hustle and bustle I took a half day off from work so I signed on at 7 and I had a meeting that lasted from 8 30 to 12 and um, I just you know kind of dropped off of that meeting early because I have this appointment that I have to get to by noon and so today um, as I stated this is the day that um, I get my bite plate and um, <laughs> I don't know guys I am you know excited that the process is is moving forward but you know as you know like I said I'm on cruise countdown right now and um, you know, I'm going to have to have this thing in my mouth pretty much 24-7. Um, the only time they really recommend that you take it out of your mouth is when you're brushing it to clean it. Um, they actually suggest that you eat with it because um, eating with it will, you know, kind of force your bite into its proper place. And so... You know it's kind of uh, similar to wearing a retainer so as a precursor to having to wear the retainer for the rest of my life I think this is a good precursor to that um, but still because I'm gonna have something kind of in the roots of my mouth I do expect for there to be some you know significant pressure um, some discomfort and so that's I'm just a little bit apprehensive about that uh, but otherwise I am excited because the process is moving along and so um, I am going to piece you guys out right here and I will see you when we get closer to the destination I'm out of the car and people are probably gonna look at me like I'm crazy which I am a little crazy but yeah um, I have like two or three minutes to spare before my appointment at noon and so your girl is making her way so I'll hit you guys up once I'm inside peace out your girl so fashion week tv in the place to be and welcome 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 to the channel your girl uh is here excuse me throat sounds and such um your girl is here and as always vlogging on her way to the dentist so um i'm going to try as i always do to get out of the driveway without shaking you guys up giving you guys shaking baby syndrome <laughs> today is friday guys and happy friday and it is the friday before we set sail on our cruise and um very very excited but again i had to come to you 
uh, with another braces vlog because I didn't get the bite plate that I anticipated receiving on this past Monday. So I'm here, I'm alive, I'm thankful, I'm grateful, all that jazz. And we are headed over to get this bite plate. Um, and then after that, I have to go into work. Um, one good thing though, I am all packed and ready to go for the most part. I have a couple of like little loose end things that I need to uh, kind of make sure that I have uh, nice and tucked away and ready for Sunday. So now guys, we fly out on Sunday to Fort Lauderdale and we are going to be in Fort Lauderdale overnight, one night. Uh, we're going to be staying in an Airbnb, which is going to be exciting. This is my first time doing um, Airbnb, so I can give you guys um, kind of like some insight. If you guys are thinking about going somewhere and staying in an Airbnb, but you were reluctant, your girl's going to show you all about it. And so, yeah, so, um, yeah, we're going to get to rock and rolling. Uh, oh, my goodness. So, I have rubber bands, right? I didn't even talk about that. So, I have rubber bands, and good thing I realized that I don't have them in because... Let me pull over to the side of the road so that I can put these bands in because I don't want my teeth going back or doing anything funky because I don't have these bands in. So, I, I kind of just brush my teeth, and that's why I don't have them in makes me very very nervous so I'm gonna pull over to the side and I'm going to put these bands in alrighty guys so I put the bands in I put the rubber bands in um, I don't know if you can see them because they're clear rubber bands I did that off camera because I was driving and of course when you're driving and you realize that you need to do something extremely important uh, the lights don't want to turn red to allow you to be great and so I didn't want to run the risk of getting into an accident so um, I did it off camera and they're successfully on there on both sides and so um, at the last visit, they told me that I needed to wear the rubber bands because um, of my overbite and because of the spaces in my teeth. And so uh, specifically, I believe what she wants to do is she wants to appropriately align my canine teeth, which due to my overbite are not um, lining up properly. Um, so wearing the rubber bands uh, from my back molars uh, to the, it's like the fourth tooth. I'll put a diagram or something in to show you exactly what I'm talking about. Um, to kind of line things up. And these are the bands that I am wearing. These are the heavy, um, extra heavy bands. And that is what they look like. Yeah, I'm gonna be wearing that. I don't know, you know, what the duration time is that I'll have to wear them. Um, but I'm supposed to be wearing them for 24 hours until further notice. So, uh, with the exception of brushing and eating, um, I should have the rubber bands in even like through sleeping. So, um, that's been okay. And, um, you know, I'm not going to even sit here and tell you that this is easy because it isn't. This is probably the first time uh, during my treatment that I've experienced the most discomfort. We'll see what happens when I get the bite plate because the bite plate is removable, but I'm supposed to wear it just as much as I'm wearing the, um, the rubber band. So... Uh, the treatment plan for the bite plate is the exact same and I'm experiencing a lot of pressure that I've never experienced before uh, wearing the rubber band so I could only imagine uh, what I'm going to be experiencing once the bite plate is placed. Now this is not 
going to be like the traditional braces appointment. She's not going to be doing any type of adjustment. I got my adjustment done uh, this past Monday. Uh, so all I expect to be doing when I go in here is picking up the bike pleat and leaving. Um, so I'll see what footage I can get while in the office and then we will connect once I'm back in the car, I'm headed to work. And then from there, guys, it's 10 days of fun in the sun uh, in Fort Lauderdale. Then we will be cruising uh, the Caribbean. And then we'll be back in Miami for like four days on South Beach. So um, these are going to be some really interesting vlogs coming up. I'm trying to make it as fun as possible and on par with the traditional content that I upload here on the channel. So right now we're doing braces, we're doing uh, maintenance after weight loss surgery. So I'm going to make sure that I um, keep the content consistent and tying it all in. So be very, very excited. I'm gonna piece you guys out here and I will see you either in the dentist office or immediately following the appointment with all kinds of lisp and speech impediments with this bite plate. And uh, yeah, see you then. Okay, um, I can't even see myself, but hello people. Huh? I'm vlogging. Oh, you're vlogging can't see myself but um I'm on here and um it's the next day because I did vlog yesterday and um I don't have the bike plate and I don't have it because the incompetent people at the dentist office didn't get it in uh so I'm gonna do a full sit down talk about them and how we plan to rectify that situation but uh, yeah say hello Jack hey y'all I don't even know if I got him on there but hi how are you um, so right now we're at Garden State Plaza Mall and we're just walking through um, I need to go to Against all odds, there's a store here in the mall that I have to go to to do a return for my son because he's in a growth spurt phase. So I bought him size small joggers and he can't fit them. So yeah, we're taking those back. And then Chet waited for the last minute to get his stuff for the food. Yeah, yeah, whatever. So I'm guessing he'll have to shop around a couple of stores. Chet got bags. Check got bags. Yes, check got bags. He made some progress. We right there. So we feel miserably at vlogging in the mall. There's so much stuff going on. You're looking at stuff, wanting to try on stuff. So we feel miserably, but he did manage to snag some stuff. So that's a blessing. So now we're on our way to the next stop, which is to get my hair cut. I did see these really nice biker shorts in the pink store that I wanted to get, but I'll kind of think about that. And if I get them, I'll show you guys. You know, but this last minute guy got some stuff. Yeah, that's what we got it. And so, yeah, that's a blessing from above. So, next up is to get, oh, gas. We can get gas on the way. What are we gonna take to George Washington? Oh, uh, it's close this way, yeah. From, uh, yeah, so, I'm gonna piece you guys out right here and we'll be back on in a little bit. Maybe when I get my hair cut. 